All five of these business models can make you a millionaire. What it do hustlers, it's your boy Drell here coming at you with another video today. And in this video right here, I'm gonna be going over five different business models that you can start that can make you over a million dollars in 2020. Now, before I get started with this video, I just wanna say that all of these business models require a lot of work. This isn't a get rich quick scheme or anything like that. You're gonna have to put in work. You're gonna have to sacrifice a lot in order to get to a million dollars or anything like that. So don't think that this is get rich quick scheme or that you can make money right away doing these different business models because you simply can't. You're gonna have to put in a lot of work, like I said. You're gonna have to sacrifice a lot of things as well. You're gonna have to be disciplined and all of that. All of that plays a major factor into making a million dollars and everything like that. So make sure that you keep that in mind. I don't want you guys to get the wrong mindset going into them. But these five business models are extremely, extremely profitable and they have extreme upside. So let's get right into the first business model, which is YouTube. What you're watching right now, YouTube is a great way to make some money online in 2020. Now, I know a lot of the changes have been coming to YouTube, but YouTube is still a great way to earn some money. Now, I'm about to take you guys on one of my YouTube channels. It's not this one, it's another one that I have that I'm actually making over a thousand dollars a month just from YouTube ads on that channel. So let me hop into my computer so I can show you guys some proof real quick. All right, man, so I'm on my YouTube channel right now. Now, this channel is called Drell Jones. This channel talks more about affiliate marketing and all of that good stuff, which I'll get into in the next business model. But as you can see on this channel, right, the revenue I made 1300 in the last 28 days. Let me actually go to my analytics. As you can see, I posted today as well. And let's go to channel analytics. Now in the last 28 days, like I said, I made $1,300. Now let's go last 90 days to see how much I made. I made over $4,000 in the last 90 days. Now this is just with YouTube ads. I make money through affiliate marketing on that channel, selling online products like my own online course and everything like that. So that brings this number up way like three, four X this number from my other ways to making money on that channel. But YouTube is a great opportunity. Even if you don't have your own products, you could do affiliate marketing on your channel and you can make money through YouTube ads. You can um, get sponsorships and all of that. So YouTube is a great way. And as long as you're providing value, I'm gonna give you guys some tips for YouTube and everything like that. As long as you're providing value and being yourself, you will get subscribers, man. So don't think that it's too late to start YouTube because no one is you and that is your superpower like i know you probably heard that before but it's true no one is you no one can deliver the type of content that you can and the way that you can do it right so that's your superpower man use that to your advantage just be unique so if you're out here trying to be somebody else then that's where you might fall that's where you might fail at because you're not being yourself but if you're being yourself there's no way that you can fail because no one else is you and you'll be unique automatically man so just be yourself and provide value provide as much value as you can in your videos and people will start subscribing to you they'll start liking your videos sharing your videos and that's how you grow fast on youtube and i started this channel about a year ago so it wasn't too long ago that I started making videos on this channel and I got over a hundred videos on this channel. So that's another thing. You have to be consistent on YouTube. You have to be consistent in whatever you do in life, really. But yeah, man, YouTube is a great way to make some money online. As you saw, I made over $4,000 in the last three months for YouTube. Now, like I said, that's just one income stream from YouTube. I got multiple income streams coming off of that one channel on YouTube. And I also just made this channel as well. And I got another channel that I didn't show y'all as well. That's not showing my face. The Drell Jones channel that I showed you guys earlier, that's the channel of me showing my face. And I'm showing my face on this channel as well. But I got another channel that I'm not showing my face on as well. And I'm making money from on that channel. So I'm not just telling you guys stuff that I'm not doing myself. You see me on YouTube right now. You see one of my other channels that where I'm showing my face and then I got another one where I'm not showing my face. So I practice what I preach. YouTube is a great way to make some money online. Now let's get into the second method, which is affiliate marketing. Now affiliate marketing is where you're selling other people's products and you're getting a commission for it. So that's what I talk about a lot on Jarrell Jones, like my other channel. I talk about affiliate marketing with ClickBank. Now ClickBank, 
I'll go ahead and um, type it in right now so that you can see the website. But you do not have to use ClickBank. ClickBank is just one of the um, most popular websites when it comes to affiliate marketing. But I'm gonna just click on ClickBank and we're gonna go over to the affiliate marketplace and we're gonna search. All right, so as you can see, they got all of these different products, right? Now you can search it by different categories. So let's say you're in a health and um, fitness niche, right? So let's go over to health and fitness. They got a bunch of different products that you can promote on. Now, let's say you got a YouTube channel, you're um, making videos on how to lose weight, you're posting workout videos and everything like that. And the description of your YouTube channel, you could be linking to one of these ClickBank products, right? And every time someone goes and purchases the ClickBank product through your link, you get a commission for it. So as you can see, the average sell on this is $68, 37, 31, 44. So that means every single sale, you'll be making some money, man. So that's a great way to make some money. You do not have to have the products yourself. You do not have to create your own products. You can market other people's products and get a commission for it. They handle everything else, the customer service, the product delivery, and all of that good stuff. All you have to do is drive traffic to it. And if people purchase it, you get a commission for it. So that's what I started off with. Like when I very, very got started off in business, that's what I got started with before YouTube, before everything. That's how I'm able to teach affiliate marketing on my other channel. Cause that's what I did before I even got started with YouTube and I made thousands and thousands of dollars with affiliate marketing. Like this year alone, I made over $50,000 with affiliate marketing. So it's a great business model to start off with. And you can start off with free traffic. So you can start off with YouTube, affiliate marketing on YouTube. You can do it on Instagram and everything like that. So you can get started for free with affiliate marketing as well. Don't have to have a product. You're just marketing other people's products. Now the third business I wanna share in this video is SMMA, right? So this is social media marketing agency. So this is where you're helping businesses get more clients and things like that. Or you can be like their Instagram manager or something like that. It's just helping people get more clients, grow their audience and everything like that. So let's say for example, right? One of my pages on Instagram, I got like 50,000 followers on Instagram, right? If I see a younger page, a page that only got a thousand followers, I can hit them up and ask them if they would like for me to help them grow their Instagram account, if they would like for me to post on their page and everything like that, just to help them grow their account and I could charge them a fee. So let's say the fee is a um, thousand dollars a month to help grow their Instagram and everything like that. And people actually do that. Like, so for me, right, I didn't get into this too heavy, but I did have three clients that I did this for and I charged them $500 a month to manage their Instagram accounts and help them grow it. So if you're good at growing Instagram accounts, you could do that and make some extra money. There's no out of pocket cost for you. All you're doing is helping people grow their Instagram accounts. Now, another way that you can do this, right, is that you could go to like local dentists or doctors, um, stuff like that people that like specialized in something so let's say dentist for example you can go and contact some dentists and ask them if they would like for you to help them get more clients and then you run some facebook ads for them and then they pay you a retainer so this will be higher so this will be way higher than instagram like you can charge them like 2500 dollars a month to help them get more clients because a client to a dentist is worth way way more than 2500 dollars a month right so the lifetime value of the customer, like you gotta know all of that, the lifetime value of the customer and everything like that. And you could charge more if you're doing dentists and things like that. But yeah, that's social media marketing agency. You can read more about it. Um, I'm not too specialized in it. So I just give you guys what I know. I did mostly Instagram, just managing people's Instagram accounts. So if you wanna check that out, if you wanna try that out, you can. Now the fourth business model is blogging. Now blogging, I'm actually pulling my blog real quick so that you can see it. Now, as you can see, I'm on a website called Online Gems. Now, this goes with the YouTube channel that I showed you guys previously, the Drell Jones YouTube channel. Now, this blog is for ClickBank affiliate marketing and all of that good stuff. So, if you're a writer, this is for writers, right? Um, YouTube is more for people that like being on camera. I don't really like being on camera, but I had to um, force myself to do it. But I don't really like writing either. So, that's why I didn't make too many um, posts on my blog. So, I'd rather do video than to write all day, but that's just me personally. You might be more of a writer than you are like wanting to be on video, but it's just a personal choice. 
Now, blogging is a great way to make some money. Now, the thing about blogging and YouTube is that it's SEO traffic, so people are actually searching for your content. So let's say you got a weight loss blog, right? And you could do some affiliate marketing on your blog as well. I'm about to talk to you guys how to do that. So let's say you got a weight loss blog, right? You make content on the top five ways to lose weight. And then in that article, you could do some affiliate marketing. So this goes back to um, ClickBank. You could go on ClickBank, get a product on weight loss, and then add that affiliate link in your blog. So let me actually try to find an affiliate link real quick in this blog. Um, so here's an affiliate link right here. So building your landing page. This is an affiliate link to ClickFunnels, your 14 day free trial here. When they click on this, it's my affiliate link. So if they sign up to it, I get a commission for it. So that's how affiliate marketing, blogging, and everything like that works. You're just creating content, people search it up, they find your content, and if you provide them with a product or service that matches their needs, they're going to purchase it and you get a commission for it. Now, that's not the only way that you can make money blogging. You can make money from your blog through sponsorships. You can make money through your blog through ads and everything like that. So there's multiple ways that you can monetize your blog as well. So if you're a writer, try out blogging. Now, the last business model I want to cover in this video is Shopify dropshipping. There's a lot of people doing it and there's a lot of people making money from it. Now, I did this in the past. This was about a year and a half ago and I made some money with it. But the only thing was I couldn't keep up with it because I didn't have enough money. Now, so if you're going to be doing dropshipping, just know that you're going to have to run ads for it. Like, unless you got an Instagram account that you already built up and that you can drive traffic to your store with, you're going to have to run ads for drop Shopify dropshipping. Now, for those that don't know what dropshipping is, you must be living under a rock. But it's basically where, like, you create an online store with Shopify, right? And you have these products listed, right? It could be like a bracelet, a hoodie, even like a hoodie, a headband, or something like that. And then you outsource the products from like AliExpress or something like that. So on AliExpress, the um the prices be like 50 cents for like a headband. Let's say for a headband, we were marketing this headband on our website, right? On the website, we could sell it for like ten dollars and we get it from AliExpress for like 50 cents and then we keep the profit. So that's basically what drop shipping is. AliExpress is gonna ship the product to the customer. But yeah, there's tons and tons of people making money drop shipping. So if you wanna find like the people that are making money drop shipping, just type in on YouTube, Shopify drop shipping. Like I can't really give you too much information about it cause I'm not doing it myself currently. But yeah, all you gotta do is type in on YouTube, Shopify drop shipping, and there's a bunch of people making money from it. So if you want to get into that business model, you can as well. But those are the top five business models, in my opinion, to get started with in 2020. I recommend that you pick one though. Pick one and stick to one. Because if you start too many different businesses, if you start all five of these, for example, your focus is going to be split in five different ways. So you're only going to be able to put 20% in each business model, which simply is not going to work out. So just go all in on one, put 100% of your time and effort into one so that you can make the most out of it and that you can make as much money as you want from that business model. So that's all I have for today's video, man. If you found it viable, make sure that you drop a like on it. Make sure that you comment down below any questions you have. And if that button is red down below, make sure that you subscribe to join the gang of hustlers. And I'm out, bro. I'll see you guys in the next video.